Hi, welcome to yogadownload.com. I'm Jackie Cassell Maru, and I'm going to lead you through this very quick stand up and stretch class. This class is designed for you, for anybody that needs a quick stretch break. You can do this at the office, in your cubicle, really anywhere. You don't need a yoga mat, you can keep your shoes on if you want to. Here with me today is Amber Buecher. She's going to be demonstrating the postures with me in case you need a visual. Come to your feet, so stand up. And bring your feet hip width distance apart. So take a look at them, make sure they're right underneath your hips. And just press all four corners of your feet down into the ground. Firm up your legs, so engage your quads, engage your thighs. Lengthen your spine and lift your chest. Pull your shoulders back and turn your palms just to face forward. Close your eyes for a moment. Let's come to the breath. Just take a quick moment here just to shelve anything that you're doing, mentally shelve it, let go of your to-do list and anchor yourself right here in the present moment. Come in your body, come in your skin and just feel the sensations. Take a breath in together through your nose, exhale through your mouth. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your nose. Inhale through your nose. Through the nose again, exhale. Open your eyes. Reach your arms up and over your head. Just stretch up as tall as you possibly can. Reach out of your waist up towards the ceiling. Press your feet down into the floor and reach your arms up as tall as you can. Just feel how good it feels to stretch, to lengthen. Now take your right hand and grab a hold of your left wrist. You can turn your left palm to face in front of you. Gently press both of your feet into the mat and lean over to your right side. Don't fall over to the right, but consciously lift out of your waist and lean in that direction. You can pull on your left wrist a little bit too. Now from here, bend both of your elbows and take your right hand, grab a hold of your left elbow. Your left hand can grab a hold of your right elbow. Pull your chin from your chest and just lean a little bit over to your right. If it feels good, you can look up, turning your head a little bit. And release, return to center. Reach your arms up, give it a big stretch. And then we'll do the other side. Left hand to right wrist first, lift up, stay grounded in your feet, and then lean over to the left. So by grounded, I just mean pressing all four corners of your feet into the mat. Pull your chin from your chest, lean a little bit more to the left. Now bend your elbows, grab a hold of each opposite elbow and just lean a little bit more and you can pull on your right elbow with your left hand to get a deeper stretch through your shoulder and side body. Look up if that feels good on your neck. And then release, reach your arms up one more time. Interlace your fingers, flip your palms up to face the ceiling, stretch out your hands. Maybe you've been typing all day texting, writing, press up and stretch. Stretch out all the fascia in your hands. And then release, bring your arms by your side. You can let some blood flow back into your hands, into your arms. From here, interlace your hands behind your back. So if you're able to, you'll bring your palms to touch behind you. If not, you can just grab a hold of your wrists. Press down through your feet, engage your legs, Squeeze your shoulder blades a bit together behind you. Lift your chin a little bit from your chest and just start to back bend a little bit. Just open your chest up towards the ceiling. And if it feels good, if you're really flexible, you can back bend a lot here, but you don't have to. Just get the opening through your chest. You might have been rounded over a computer all day or driving. Whatever you're doing, I have a feeling this is a good counter stretch for it. Look up and breathe and release. Come back to center, back to a neutral neck. Keep your hands behind your back. Take your right hand and grab a hold of your left wrist. From here, hold on to your wrist and pull it down a little bit. 
Now, just look directly in front of you, but bring your right ear towards your right shoulder. As you bring your right ear towards your right shoulder, pull down on your left wrist a little bit to get a deep stretch through the side of your neck. Find a sweet spot and just hold and breathe there. to center. Take the other side. Take your left hand to your right wrist. Press down through your feet and then pull your right wrist down. Chin is at neutral and bring your left ear now towards your left shoulder. And you can get a deeper stretch if you pull down on your right wrist. You can kind of lift your chin up a little bit, find that sweet spot and then just hold. Just let the tension in your body dissolve. It will over time and with a lot of practice. And release. Slowly come back up to center. From where you are, bring your hands together at your heart or you can bring them onto your waist. Bend your knees and sit your hips back. Figure four, we call this. Take your right ankle on top of your left knee and then sit back. And if you have a desk and balance is an issue, you can place your hands on a chair or a desk for balance. Otherwise, you can just keep your hands together at prayer or bring them to rest on your right lower leg. But sit back so that you can really feel the stretch through your right glute. It's okay if you lose your balance, it happens. Focus your eyes on one point. And release slow. Shift into your right foot. Take your left foot up. Left ankle rests on your lower right knee and just sit back. You can take your hands to your heart, rest them on your chair or your desk, or rest them on your lower leg. Focus your eyes on one point. Blink as you need to. If you can, take some deep breaths while you're here. Feel the hips stretching out. up to standing. From here, shift into your left foot, bend your right knee, take your left hand to the outside of your right knee. You can take your right arm and reach it behind you if you have space, otherwise you can bring your right palm to your lower back. Twist your spine, squeeze your stomach muscles in, just giving your spine a little rinse here. and release, come back to center. Other side, shift into your right leg, take your left foot up, bend it, take your right hand to the outside of your left knee, keep your spine long. Your left hand can come to your lower back or if you have the space, you can reach it behind you. Keep your eyes on one point, that will help with your focus, your concentration, and your physical balance. Twist a little deeper and release slow left foot all the way down to the mat. One more posture today. Reach your arms up and over your head, give it a stretch. If you're close to your desk, you might wanna back away a little bit, just make sure you have space. We're just gonna bend over. So slowly from here, just bow down over your legs. Separate your feet hip width distance apart, just giving your back body a little bit of a stretch. Feel free to bend your knees if you need to. Don't judge yourself or your flexibility. It's taken years to tighten up your body. It's going to take some time and practice to loosen it up. Take a few breaths here.
And then from here, look forward, take your hands to your hips, press down through your feet, come all the way up to standing. Take your hands to your heart, close your eyes. We'll end with three breaths in through the nose and out through our mouths. Sigh out any tension. Take a breath in together, the fullest one you can take. Exhale through your mouth. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. Again, inhale. Exhale. And slowly open your eyes. Namaste, and thank you for joining us at yogadownload.com. If you liked this quick session, please check out some of our other longer sessions. Have a great day.